Hello and welcome to ZTEX webinar on improving heat exchanger inspection analysis. My name is Wayne Waxman and I'm the Director of Marketing at ZTEC. I'd like to thank everyone for joining us. I do have a couple of logistical items before we get started. You're all in listen only mode and we are recording today's session so you can review and listen to it or share with colleagues in your organization. Everyone who registered for this webinar will receive an email later this week with a link to the recording. Finally, there will be a Q&A session at the end of this webinar, but you don't need to wait until the end to send in a question at any time during the webinar. Just type your inquiry in that questions box on the GoToWebinar panel on your screen. Before we begin the webinar, I'd like to give a quick overview of ZTEC. ZTEC is a global leader in NDT. For 50 years, we've advanced the science and standards in both ultrasonic and eddy current technologies, setting new heights in inspection performance, productivity, and predictability. ZTEC's proven expertise and complete product portfolio serve the inspection needs of our customers worldwide in transportation, power generation, manufacturing, and oil and gas. ZTEC is a subsidiary of Roper Technologies. Let's get to today's session, which will be presented by Tom Bipes and Jerry Park on video. Tom Bipes is a project manager in the Revospect and EddyNet software business at ZTEC. Tom has been involved in NDE for the past four decades. He has, held, he has held roles in vendor services, vendor field services, education, and NDE research. Tom's current role is project manager of Revospec and EddyNet applications, as well as field operations for ZTEC. Jerry Park is a sales and applications engineer at ZTEC. He has been with the company for over 14 years where he has worked as a field operator in acquisition and analysis, as well as working with the engineering team, designing and testing both hardware and software products. With that, let's get to today's webinar. Thanks, Wayne. I want to thank you all for attending today's webinar. I'm really excited about the technology I'm about to share with you. I prepare the agenda you see in front of you to give you an idea of how this presentation will unfold. First, I will briefly talk about the challenges we have seen in the way inspections are typically performed today. Then we will talk about some of the enabling technologies within the system that make it perform. From there, I'll queue up a video with Jerry Park to demonstrate the system in action where you'll be able to truly see the value this system can provide. From there, I will explain some of the background of Revospect HX Pro, information about the use of historic data compare, plus a bit about our signal inject program, ZTEX signal injection tool. Finally, we'll wrap up with a summary and then we'll take your questions. There are various factors in the current heat exchanger inspection process that detract from the ability to improve component reliability. Often, only a sample of the component tube population is examined with eddy current testing. This is often due to inspection costs and scheduling during a busy refuel or turnaround outage. During the inspection, the plan scope may also be reduced due to other dynamics of the outage. Because of component unreliability, inspection requirements may need to change. Oversight engineers are often reacting to component operability issues. To better diagnose tube integrity of the component, there may be a need for increased inspection frequency and the use 
of more complex inspection techniques, such as array probes. Poor performance from service vendors elevates quickly within the view of utilities and asset owners. With higher expectations on asset performance due to competitive energy pricing and operational goals, asset owners are demanding fast and competitive delivery of inspection services to get the assets quickly back online. Vendors striving to meet the challenge and provide fast and competitive inspections are at risk of performance issues when humans are placed in stressful service. All of these factors accumulate in plant management questioning the effectiveness of eddy current testing. Trending of inspection results may be difficult with traditional tracking techniques and reduced inspection scope. The RevelSpec HX solution allows for various enhancements to inspection results tracking for better performance predictions. CTEC is excited to offer an integrated solution that automates and refines the process from acquisition through analysis of the inspection data. The use of this automated process will increase the inspection productivity dramatically to address inspection issues such as scheduling demands, available manpower, and the aging workforce. Automation of the process will also help provide shorter inspection turnaround and standardized techniques for varying inspector experience levels. The time to complete analysis and final reporting is on critical path for the asset owners to disposition the component and return it to service. The service vendor is typically working with a manual process and tools and has a lot of pressure to produce the final results and little ability to improve the time. Often the final report is delivered later than the asset owner would expect. ZTEC automated acquisition and analysis solutions will increase the number of tube inspections performed in the allotted timeframe. These processes will also ease the transition to advanced inspection technologies, such as array probe inspection data. Automation addresses redundant acquisition and analysis tasks that can lead to human performance issues. The first step of this enhanced process is to automate the acquisition workflow. Automation controls the probe movement from insertion of the probe into the tube through retraction and recording of the tube data. This enhancement of these manual tasks lead to less quantity of tasks for the operator, providing the operator more focus on the critical aspects of the inspection. Automated analysis with RevelSpec HX provides the needed consistency and reliability for detection and classification of tube flaws. The process is also very repeatable and reduces overall human error that can result from tedious manual analysis. Automation enhances the abilities of the analyst and therefore brings the inspection resources to the same high level of capability. Analyst test results are now available earlier in the inspection process. Let's watch a short video presentation by Jerry Park, demonstrating the automated acquisition and analysis RevelSpec HS solution in action.
All right, now let's see everything working together at the same time. You should now see a split screen with the acquisition software over on the left, top left side and the analysis dashboard over on the left, bottom left side. Now, I'm going to go ahead and start my acquisition. And we can see how everything works together in real time. Okay. So in the acquisition software, you'll see the data scrolling. Uh, the color is green, and then the color changes to blue once it starts recording. And then over on the test plan side, you can see uh, the status of that tube changing once it has completed uh, recording. And then you can also see the encodes update to the next um, tube as I complete the recording. Okay. Now over on the uh, dashboard side, you can see the list of tubes there. As I'm recording the data, you will see new tubes populating in that list. And you can see the status of the analysis process. So you should see another tube populate, and it's being recorded, and now it's complete. All right. So the process is very fast. You can see here, I'm, I can go from tube to tube fairly quickly, and the analysis process keeps up um, without any problem. Okay. Okay. And I'll do a couple more here, uh, so you can see everything working together, and you can see that it's very fast. Yeah, I'll do one more for good measure. There you have it. Now let's take a closer look at the analysis software. All right, so here um, on our dashboard, you can see uh, that there are some reported indications. Um, they all have three indications because obviously I was testing the same tube. The mock-up tube that I was recording has some flaws we put into it. So let's take a look at those flaws here. I'm going to bring up my report editor. Uh, so this is a list of all the reports that the analysis software made. Um, you can see that there are three entries for each tube. Now to bring up the report, all I have to do is double click on the report of interest. And then you can see that it will uh, automatically load into the analysis software. So here, uh, you can see the indication that the software called and how it w made that call, um, such as channel um, and uh, what kind of measurement it made and the indication code that it used. Uh, so here, um, we can flip through each indication um, by using this button, next and previous, so if I do a left click on the mouse, it will go to the next indication in the report. Um, and if I do a right click, it'll go to the previous indication in the report. And this way I can cycle through all the indications um, and review everything that the software has done. Thanks, Jerry, for that wonderful presentation on RevelSpect HX in action. In today's inspections, we commonly see a team of three people with individual responsibilities to perform the vessel inspection. 
This is common for heat exchangers ranging from hundreds to thousands of tubes. In the top illustration, the first person, starting on the left, is what we will call the acquisition probe handler. His responsibility is to either hold a conduit to direct the probe into the desired tube if a probe pushing device is used, or to push the probe manually into the tube to be inspected and withdraw it at a constant speed while the data file is recorded. Moving to the right, the second person is the acquisition operator. And his primary function is to run the acquisition software. He's in tight communication with the acquisition probe holder to coordinate the recording of the data when the acquisition operator moves the probe and synchronize the tube location being acquired. The third person in the team is the data analyst. His obvious role is to analyze the data coming from acquisition. Depending on the job, there may be several teams like this deployed to inspect multiple vessels in parallel. The data analyst is com commonly in a trailer or building where the data from acquisition team is passed to him via a USB drive that is hand delivered. The frequency of data delivery varies, but in many cases it's around four hours or a complete shift. As you can see, this sets up a batch cycle for the analysis activity, causing a built-in delay after the completion of acquisition. This delay leads to around an eight-hour period to wrap up the analysis and complete the preliminary report. The final report is often done off-site for convenience and in some cases can take up to a week to submit. In this example, we are looking at more than one week to produce the final results for the inspection. Improving inspection cycles for cases similar to this example can provide great value to the asset owner. Let's revisit our model of the inspection in the lower graphic. This time, we're going to explain it with the Revel Spect HX solution. We'll start off with just a single operator and illustrate how the system can perform the entire process of what had been previously done with three people. We will equip this one-man team with an eddy current instrument, Pro Pusher, Bobbin Probe, and RevoSpect HX. Again, remember that RevoSpect HX is the integrated software that performs acquisition and analysis. As the RevoSpect HX is going to both acquire and analyze the data, we don't have to deliver data periodically to the analysis team in the trailer or offsite location. The acquisition features are going to manage the probe movement in an efficient and controlled manner. And the analysis features are going to process the acquired data automatically. This lets the operator focus on probing the tubes. With this model, we expect a nearly 100% improvement in efficiency. So the acquisition of the data can be accomplished in around eight hours compared to the previous model of the manual system and three people that consumed almost 16 hours or two days to acquire all of the tubes. In reality, the analysis of the data is nearly instantaneous with acquisition, analyzing at around 15 seconds per tube. How do we know this? We deployed systems in oil and gas and power plant facilities and benchmark the performance of both the manual and the RevelSpect HX models. With the analysis progressing near the rate of acquisition, preliminary reports can be produced within an hour of completion. For the final report, the operator can review the analysis results and provide some oversight 
to then produce a final report in about eight hours. Next, we'd like to share some background on the RevoSpect HX solution development. ZTEC has a long-standing goal of supplying inspection hardware and technology for the industry NDE inspection industry. ZTEC recognized a convergence of events indicating a need for applying advanced technology to the analysis of heat exchanger inspection data. Various items led to this decision, including an aging analysis workforce and shrinking availability of experienced data analysts. It has also been shown that analyst experience levels within the wide variety of heat exchanger components and degradation mechanisms can limit the inspection capabilities. With aging plants and heat exchanger components, the reliability is becoming reduced, which causes an increase in down power events and unplanned component replacement. The industry as a whole has been somewhat stagnant in the development of new technologies, assuming the asset owner is comfortable with current inspection capabilities. RevoSpect HX uses proven RevoSpect technology that has been used for many years in the steam generator inspection industry. <coughs> RevoSpect HX harnesses this proven technology to automate the acquisition and analysis process for almost any plant heat exchanger. These technologies provide a solid solution to address inconsistencies in analysis results due to the previously described human manual analysis component. Automation of the acquisition and analysis process provides for the inspection of components at a higher data acquisition rate with improved reliability and consistency. The overall process becomes transparent, but provides for the flexibility to address near-term and future inspection needs. Speaking of the analysis, I will give a brief description of how analysis occurs with the RevoSpect HX technology we have integrated into RevoSpect HX. ZTEC has approached auto analysis in a very methodical way. We developed a modular analysis structure where in signal processing space, we define the mathematical equation used to find, qualify, and report a specific flaw type. We call this equation an analyzer. In fact, considering that data can be influenced by other conditions such as noise, deposits, etc., it's a good practice to have various analyzers for a given flaw type to ensure good performance. It's very handy to have these multiple analyzers grouped together so they can be easily assigned to targeted regions of the tube. We call this grouping an analysis capsule. With our analysis capsule methodology, you put together a analysis configuration. This configuration contains all the capsules you need for the particular inspection. Pretty neat and tidy. ZTEC is building an extensive library of capsules for customer use. When a customer implements a capsule from ZTEC, there is a simple interface where the user can make adjustments to the capsule changing performance to meet their needs. 
In this graphic, a typical bobbin probe inspection technique is being utilized. Capsules are built to address all of the active and potential damage mechanisms for the component to be inspected. The computer processes the data and it is analyzed by each of the specific analysis capsules. If multiple capsules classify a signal to more than one potential flaw mechanism, a logic path we call final acceptance is used to rationalize the results. For example, the examination results may provide a differential channel flaw signal and an absolute channel flaw signal at the same location. Final acceptance will utilize logic steps that you select to determine which signal response has priority and is therefore reported. Likewise, a configuration may be produced that uses multiple techniques, such as bobbin array combination probes. Two configurations, one for each technique, can be applied with separate RevelSpec HX capsule sets. Final acceptance can rationalize the results of signals produced from both bobbin and array techniques. You may be thinking, what assets are needed to provide the necessary data for RevelSpec HX to function at its highest level? Some of these assets include the historic data and results from previous inspections. Of course, the inspection techniques and practices developed for the specific component will be utilized to develop the RevelSpec HX techniques. Once a configuration is developed, it is tested by utilizing the previous inspection data, then comparing results to that of the inspection truth or previously reported results. ZTEC signal inject may also be used to enhance this process of validation by producing real and artificial flaw signals to prove the capabilities of the system. More about signal inject later in this presentation. ZTEC has also made enhancements to tube support structure locating or landmarking as structure locating is imperative to successful automated analysis to ensure the proper capsules and techniques are applied to each specific region of interest, or as we say, ROI. This process ensures the proper degradation reporting is maintained. ZTEC RevelSpec HX can be deployed at your facility in a variety of ways. Utilizing ZTEC acquisition test equipment and probe handling hardware integrated with RevelSpec HX can allow for automated acquisition and analysis with minimal staffing. A preliminary report of the inspection results can be provided soon after the acquisition of inspection data is completed. A second solution is to produce analysis results and have a data analyst review the RevelSpec HX produced results to make a final decision on results from challenging components. This is an interactive automated analysis process. Other solutions include the ability to perform offline trending of historical versus current inspection results. One example of this is to perform automated structure mapping of secondary structure, such as tube stakes. Stakes may be added to components such as a main condenser to improve tube rigidity and help avoid tube structure fretting wear. 
RevelSpec HX can be configured to map the added structures and record their positions to provide further enhanced flaw algorithms specifically for those structures. Quite recently, Palo Verde using ZTEC RevelSpec HX Pro received an NEI that is the Nuclear Energy Institute TIP Award. TIP stands for Top Innovative Practice. This prestigious award was from Palo Verde operations have been significantly challenged within the three recent down power events caused by tube leaks in their low pressure feed water heaters. In an effort to improve their component reliability and availability, Palo Verde performed a comparison of automation versus manual analysis methods on historical data. The study revealed that by applying automation to the data analysis process, a significant improvement to detecting pluggable indications was realized. It was also observed that the speed and efficiency in which the analysis results were produced were equally as significant. It has been estimated by the plant that automation could reduce outage costs by almost 100K, $100,000 per inspection and upwards of 2 million in plant down power avoidance. In this innovative approach to applying automation to the heat exchanger data analysis process, Palo Verde will be well positioned to realize these benefits for many years to come. RevelSpec HX includes other technologies developed and proven over recent years, including Historic Data Compare, or HDC. Let's review how HDC works and how it can be applied to enhance your component inspection and reliability. Through the years of eddy current inspection of components, it has been proven that eddy current inspection data is highly repeatable. Signals from the signature of the tube can be seen through inspections from many years of history. Comparison of data from the current inspection to historic inspections can prove to highlight changes in the tubing resulting from degradation over time. This comparative approach was first prototyped in the 1980s by ZTEC. More recent advancements in thinking and processing power has led to the current HDC solution. HDC improves the ability to perform historic data comparisons dramatically. In this way, it is much easier to see changes in degradation growth over time. HDC has been field proven and qualified at various customer sites across the US and internationally. Let's first discuss how the process works. <coughs> In this illustration, we are showing the current inspection data segment as the green strip chart and the historic data as the orange. The data is aligned through a proprietary process to allow for variations in the data collection speed, pull direction, and even probe type variation. The interpolated data from history is then subtracted from the current data, similar to a support structure mix. The resulting delta channel shows only the areas where the signals have changed from the previous inspection.
In this next graphic presentation, we see HDC applied to two sets of historic data. Again, the green signal is the current data. The orange data is historic data from a previous inspection. And the blue data stream is from the component baseline inspection. On the two left panes, you see the overlapped baseline and current Lissajou signal. Next to it is the baseline delta signal, which is the subtraction of the baseline data to the current data. The resulting signal shows a large change signal. On the right, we are doing a similar HDC comparison using the recent inspection results subtracted from the current results. The change here is more subtle, and to the naked eye of the manual analyzed, analyst, it is difficult to notice change. The delta change channel, however, illustrates the signal change, even though it is much smaller amount of change. RevoSpec HX signal detection can be set up to detect very small amounts of change with good reliability. Here's a short video of the HDC process to better illustrate its functionality. We start by running the HDC process. Now we see the baseline blue, historic, orange, and current green lucidus at a given location. We can zoom in on the data segment of interest. We can now show all three data sets overlaid on one display and separate them for better clarity. In the center display, we change it to show current and baseline, and in the right display, we will show the baseline delta, the difference between these two channels. The strip chart can also be changed to show the same delta channel. We can scroll through the data segment to show changes in each channel, including the delta channel. The same process can be done to display the history delta channel. You may be thinking, well, what can HDC do for me? Why do I need to consider using it? ZTEX HDC can provide full tube comparison of historic data. In a few seconds, the entire tube can be scrolled to view any significant changes that occurred since the last or historic inspection. Automatic calibration of historic data to the same settings as the current data provides a true apples to apples comparison of like data. In the field, this process can be performed by a review analyst to manually compare a signal of interest to history to look for change. A small wear flaw, for example, that does not change may provide information for decision-making on repair practices. No need to repair or plug a tube with wear if it's not growing. The RevoSpec HX configuration can also use HDC as an independent detection method to look for new indications that are present in the current data that were not there before or showed significant growth. 
This capability provides for defense in depth inspections of critical components for better reliability. Comparing history data utilizing HDC eliminates the subjectivity of manual data comparisons. Lastly, I'd like to inform you of another capability of ZTEC software, Signal Inject. This tool provides the ability to capture or create flaws and insert them into component data in order to validate or prove the analysis process and provide what if scenarios for flaws that may not be present but could be a potential damage mechanism. Signal Inject is ZTEC's tool for performing eddy current signal capture and injection. With this tool, we can simulate degradation that could occur in a component at any location along the tube. This process enhances the performance testing of the manual data analyst as well as the automated data analysis process. It can also be used to provide flaw signal training for analysts, as well as performance testing. Flaw sizes can be injected at various sizes to allow for determination of detection POD, or probability of detection. This can be done for both manual and automated analysis processes. What is signal injection? Simply put, signal injection is the ability to capture an existing signal and inject it into current data relative to the component being inspected. The source signal could be from a flaw standard or a machined flaw sample or from actual flaws from the same or another component, even from another plant. Signal injection can be applied to bobbin, rotating probe, and array data. The signal can be merged into the current data host, or it can replace the data segment as needed. Here's a short video clip demonstrating signal inject. In this example video, we are going to be using signal inject for array data. First, we adjust a capture box around the data signal in both directions. We capture the flaw and save it to a data library, naming it as desired. We then open EddyNet or Velocity and select the data and location where we want to inject the flaw we captured. In this example, we'll be inserting our captured flaw near a broached support structure, representing support where. We restart Signal Inject and we select our captured flaw from the library. We may want to adjust the voltage scale or length of the signal as well as other parameters. Phase rotation can also be adjusted to make sure the flaw follows any current physics for each channel.
When ready, the flaw is then pasted into the data stream and adjustments in position can be made. A preview of the selected adjustment is easily seen on the display. Once satisfied, the data is modified by selecting the bu Modify button. When all of our modifications are made, we create a new data file with the injected signal, leaving the original file intact. With our new data file, we can observe the flaw on any data channel or mix we desire. Signal inject can also be applied to bobbin and rotating probe data. Combination probe data, bobbin and array, can be captured and injected simultaneously with both techniques being present. Let's summarize our discussion today on heat exchanger inspection enhancements. Today, we learned how RevelSpect HX can enhance and improve heat exchanger inspections in various ways. We can reduce the amount of repetitive tasks and keep our focus on what is important, thus reducing human performance issues. We can dramatically increase the number of inspections within our given schedule to improve inspection performance and component reliability. We elevate all of our inspection resources to the same high level of capability by utilizing automated analysis and allow the analyst to focus on the most important tasks. With this enhanced technology and ease of use, we allow easier transition to utilize more advanced technology such as array and combination probes with both Bob and Ander Ray. Inspection results are obtained earlier, allowing quicker decisions on component status and repair. The RevoSpec HX solution provides automated processes to improve production and repeatability of the inspection. Automated acquisition provides better productivity to complete more inspections within the allotted schedule. Integration of RevelSpec auto analysis reduces lag time between acquisition and analysis and provides a high level of confidence in component flaw detection. Utilizing additional tools such as Signal Inject and HDC provides confidence that the inspection configuration meets all of the requirements to ensure degradation is detected and component tube integrity is maintained. Compare the RevelSpec HX solution to your current inspection program and see how you can improve your component reliability and safe plant operations.